Well done, well done. So hi Adam, hi. I'm Sabal Unalan. I have just completed my certificate three in non-emergency patient transport. Mm -hmm. I've then gone into doing the diploma of healthcare and I've just gone into the pathway into the Bachelor of Paramedicine second year. Fantastic. I've had a hairdressing salon for the last 15 years yeah. and I'm going through a complete change with VU and I couldn't mm. be happier. It's fantastic to be with you. Now imagine doing Diploma of Emergency Healthcare, which is itself a fa fabulous qualification, transitioning into the second year of the Bachelor of Paramedicine, which is a degree that the world needs more of. Correct. So welcome to you, it's just great. Why should people choose TAFE instead of uni? Well, TAFE is the backbone of the nation. If you think about it, we're building the largest hospital in the state of Victoria, about 100 metres across the road from the Footscray yes. Park campus. Now, 98% of the jobs in that hospital will be non-medical. That is, 2% are doctors. The rest is everyone else. And believe me, about half of those everything else, about 40% of the jobs, are things we train for and educate at the TAFE level. Yeah. It's not just degrees. So just think about assistant nurses and orderlies and all the work that's done in sanitation, all the various things, all the jobs that are done to make a hospital what a hospital is. Many of them are essential skills and they're in TAFE. So we often forget, without TAFE, the country stops. Did you have any idea before, because you had a career before, that you'd be ending up doing paramedicine now. So tell us, you know, when you were, say, hairdressing, I understand it was? Yes. Did you ever think you might be doing a different form of profession? I didn't think at my age that I would be changing careers and doing a completely 360, but I couldn't be happier. And I'm so grateful for finding these courses that have given me these opportunities to step into a bachelor. Oh, it's so great. And did you know, we've actually just agreed with the government, which has just been returned, to have a national center of excellence in paramedicine at our Sunshine campus. Really? Yes. Wow. So we have been promised, as a starter, $10 million from the state government to establish this, to talk about things like the triple O crisis, workforce design in the future, fixing ambulance ramping, doing research about portability of calls all over Australia. We'll be doing it here at VU in your course starting from next year. I feel very lucky. Well, so do we. Thanks a lot for being part of it.